Kobe Bryant died today at the age of 41 in a helicopter crash in California. Of course, well known for being one of the best basketball stars ever. However, his love of sport went beyond that. Genuinely a big soccer fan. Tributes being paid today uh, across Europe. AC Milan tweeting, we have no words to express how shocked we are to hear of the tragic passing of one of the greatest sportsmen of all time. The Rossonero fam, Kobe Bryant, all our thoughts are with the families of those affected by this tragic accident. You'll forever be missed, Kobe. Uh, Andrea Pirlo tweeting, you've been an example for our generation, RIP legend. So many other players tweeting similar sentiments. Meanwhile, FC Barcelona tweeted, shot by the death of Kobe Bryant, an exemplary athlete both on and off the basketball court. Our most heartfelt condolences to his family and loved ones. Rest in peace. PSG, meanwhile, the club would like to express its deepest condolences to his family and friends, to the Lakers and the NBA family after the tragic passing of Kobe Bryant, RIP legend. Uh, meanwhile, we saw Neymar score a penalty today in the second half of PSG against Lille. Two and four held up to pay tribute to Kobe, of course, his number. Um, Gab Marcotti with us. Uh, Gab, of course, much loved in the basketball community, but that love spread beyond that sport. Yeah, no question about it. I mean, I think uh, of all the, uh, the, the American basketball stars, uh, there's probably not one who, uh, who, who was as involved in football, uh, lived it as emotionally as, as Kobe Bryant. And, uh, you know, he wasn't just a fan. He obviously had, had roots on, on this side of the pond. Uh, his father, Joe Jellybean Bryant, played uh, for seven years in Italy. Kobe, Kobe moved there uh, when he was six years old and really spent his formative years from the age of six to 13 in, in various Italian cities. That's where he developed uh, his love for, uh, for AC Milan, which, which obviously continued uh, throughout the years as he got older, as, as he went to Lower Marion uh, High School in, uh, in Philadelphia, and then uh, later on into the, into, into the NBA. And, um, you know, a lot of basketball, uh, a lot of football stars are, are, are crossover basketball fans, uh, but, but this is one that really went in the other direction and, and was very much genuine. You know, he would spend his summers, uh, a lot of his summers back in Italy, um, before becoming a professional and, uh, and, and, and went to, to watch friendly matches over the summer and, uh, and really lived the sport in a very genuine way. I think it pulls us out of sport completely and out of the team really completely and just, you know, from a human perspective, a lot of us, um, you know, have, have known Kobe. Um, a lot of us have met Gigi and um, spent a little time with him after games. They're obviously, you know, huge supporters, not only of soccer, but our team in general and the, the national team in general. Um, so, you know, have met Vanessa and the other kids. So to just, you know, from a human perspective, you, your heart just goes out. It's a horrible tragedy. I think everyone's just, you know, trying to show support in whatever way they can and realize that, you know, life is so much bigger than what we're all doing here and to really uh, appreciate all the moments that we get to live. You know, you could see his drive and dedication while he was playing, but you could also see uh, a different happiness in him, I think, when he decided to retire. Um, he loved his family, he loved his wife. Um, I think he, he obviously loved his daughter, um, bringing him back to, to basketball, being able to coach her. and. Um, being able to pave the way and inspire so many people. Um, he's obviously been a big supporter of the WNBA as well, and um, somebody's going to have to pick that slack up. You know, he was he was at the forefront of it, and um, he was doing so many good things to, to change the world for the better, and um, that's what makes this really hard. Obviously, it's a, it's a big tragedy, and uh, it's uh, it, it, it is hard. It was hard in the environment. It, it's hard for for everyone. He, uh, Kobe was a uh, very big proponent of, uh, of the game and uh, he was a big supporter of, of the team and the friend of some of the, some of the players on the team. Uh, obviously, it's, uh, it's something that, that, that affected us, but uh, at uh, this point, we're, we're all sorry for, for it. Well, thank you very much for watching ESPN on YouTube. For more sports highlights and analysis, be sure to download the ESPN app. And for live streaming, premium content, and let's not forget as well, ESPN FC, seven days a week. Subscribe to ESPN+. Plus.